These two teams all tied after one. No, that left Single receiver, single receiver. Hey, you're on second down and four. Vic, man open. That's Terrell Owens. And he'll get it into enemy territory just across midfield at the 49. Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down. So the ball moves into Lion territory now. Here's first and 10 at the 49-yard line. McCaffrey, and that play goes nowhere. Taken down, losing yardage at the 50, right at midfield. It'll be a loss of a yard, and it'll be second and 11. Vic now from the 50. He gets it into the hands of Larry Fitzgerald. And it's going to be another first down as they'll get him to the ground at the Lions 39. If you're going to blitz, likely going to leave you in man coverage with this guy, and that is less than ideal. It is because just about any offense that has an elite receiver, if you blitz and have him in man coverage, you're going to him, even if he has an elite defender on him, because he usually knows where the ball is before the defender does. He'll get a nice chunk there on the first down run, and it's second and four. Now a run with McCaffrey. And forget about finding a lane. He barely had time to look up before he was planted in the backfield. They'll wind up losing three yards here. And that'll lead here to a third down. From the gun, Vic rolling to his right. And he can't find a receiver, and he's brought down. JPP cruising in for the sack that time. You never want to give up a sack. From the O-line's perspective, they hate it for several reasons, especially because they felt like they let little brother down back there in the pocket. Oh, no doubt. They have a ton of pride, and they go into every job wanting to keep that guy clean. They want that uniform with no grass stains, no dirt, nothing on it. But it's really, really difficult. You're talking about some terrific athletes who are trying to put him on the ground. Now on fourth down here, that pass knocked away and incomplete. Well, with that incompletion, Charles, let's talk about the coaching carousel. Some new guys in new places. Ron Rivera to Washington. we got Mike McCarthy in Dallas. Matt ruled up from the college ranks to Carolina. And for the Giants, Joe Judge. Any surprises in your mind? Well, I think you start with Joe Judge going to the Giants, coming from New England, where he was the special teams coach for most of his career. And this season added wide receivers to his duties. Well regarded within the ranks of the NFL. Not much known about him to the outside world. It's kind of a reveal to everyone. Joe Judge, people will now get to know who he is. Because most people thought Matt Rule was going to go to New York. He ends up in Carolina. And then, of course, Ron Rivera. He would have been a candidate for Dallas. He would have been a candidate for New York as well as Washington. And Washington never let him out of the building. That's a big time hire for them. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. They'll run with a big man, Bo Jackson. A big hitter there, a first down gain of 26 yards. All right, I've got to be careful here, all right? He's on the plus side of 30. There may be a little gray in the beard, but that's not slowing down his feet as far as he's concerned. What are you saying? I'm on the plus side of 30. Well, if you're on the plus side of 30, you don't know what I'm on the plus side of. All I know is that run right there, let us know there's still some life in those legs. Absolutely, still got a lot of life left in those legs. Now! And he'll get this one down to about the 10-yard line. A gain of three, second down. They go with Chubb on second down. And he's going to be brought down just shy of the five at the six. And it's still about three yards shy of a first as the four-yard pickup brings it to third down. On third down, this is Jackson. And he takes this one in for a Lions touchdown. A great effort there with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Lions have taken the lead.